Despite the hectic winds and frigid temperatures that encapsulated Marquette University on April 20th, 1,400 students huddled in Central Mall for the opening ceremonies of Hunger Cleanup 2013. Hunger Cleanup originated in 1989 and is one of the largest days of service at Marquette University. It was first created as a student's modest way to support the efforts of hunger and homelessness in, Mar in Milwaukee and has grown to raise awareness, support, and resources for local programs and addresses the issue of poverty. Rosa De Lucas, sophomore at Marquette University in the College of Business, who was the marketing chair, said that the program this year was a huge success and that students really embraced the idea of taking part. We have a lot of organizations that form their own groups. We have individuals that are on random teams right now. A lot of Greek life, a lot of sports teams, the basketball team is with us, which is exciting. During the program, students were split into teams and went out to 45 sites around Milwaukee, including the guest house of Milwaukee's and repairs at the breach. They helped with anything that was needed, from gardening to painting and structural repairs. Even though the work was hard and cold, students did enjoy the opportunity to volunteer and help the community. We have students that are um, dedicated to us the four years they're in Marquette. One of the biggest parts of the day was that students were able to gain awareness for the world around them and interact with the community. You know, it's a lot about the day of the event going in and helping the community, yeah, yeah. but it has a lot more to do with the after effects. And the after effects are, you know, making the commitment to the Milwaukee community. And what we try to do here is inspire students to, and to be enthusiastic about it, enjoy it, and then be motivated to go out and do some more work. 1,400 students embarked on a day to fight poverty in Milwaukee, but they returned with much more than sore backs and frozen fingers. They returned with a new outlook on life and awareness for what the world around them was truly like.